What's up everybody? It's the Common Sense Investor coming at you with another video. In this video I want to talk about Ape versus AMC. A fight that should never happen. Why? Because the two are one people. They're like brothers and sisters and together they form a force. And Adam Aaron has told us that. He said if you take an Ape and you take an AMC and put them together you get the price of AMC. He didn't say, look at the price of AMC. He didn't say, now, y'all watch Ape, because Ape's going to be the squeeze. No, he gave us a clue. Add one Ape, add one AMC, bring them together, and that's the price. Now, when I heard that, I took it as, well, what if AMC runs up to 30, and Ape runs up to 50? Well, then that would be the same equivalent of AMC being 80. Now, if you transferred your ape, if you sold your ape, and you went all in AMC, again, the first thing I would say is you went to bed on the 19th with 100 shares of the most manipulated stock on the planet. And you woke up on the 22nd, and you still had 100 shares of the most manipulated stock on the planet. And a hundred shares of trust me bras. What do you mean by trust me bro? Well, you know where I get that from. I watch that some bitch too. Trust me is what Adam Aaron is saying. He said, I've got a company to run. And I understand about y'all squeeze. Now, the best that we can do is this. Trust me, bro. <laughs> so, you really have a choice. It's not rather, should you sell Ape and buy more AMC, or should you sell your AMC now and get Ape? The question is, are you going to trust Adam Aaron that he has our best interest in mind? Both the company and the shareholders. The battle is not with Ape versus AMC. The battle is rather you're going to trust Adam Aaron to get us through this. Now, I'll admit, I didn't like the idea of the ape. Kind of still don't, but it's growing on me <laughs> because I see the opportunity. Will I be buying more AMC in the future? Yes. But what I will do is I will look at the price of AMC and the price of ape, and whichever one is cheaper. I'll go with that one. And you might ask, well, CSI, if you believe AMC is the most manipulated stock on the planet, why would I continue to stay in the play? Well, because I believe in us. I believe that the little man will win in the end. It's history. That's how countries are formed. When the underdog wins. So I look at it and I go, eight versus AMC. And the thing that both of them have in common is it's the same captain driving both ships. So if I'm going to have one or the other or both, I'm going to have to have conviction that he knows what he's doing and he's not here to hurt us so with that I guess I'll let y'all go but I just wanted to let y'all know the common sense thing you know I'm still in this play and you have to have conviction if you're gonna stay in the play and if you've been in the play this long and you're giving up now Kind of reminds me of that picture where the guy's picking through the rock and the diamonds and the gold is on just a little bit more ahead of him, but he gave up. Oh, my nose, my red nose. I'm Rudolph. They don't let me play in their reindeer games. <laughs> That's why they ignore me in their streams, even though I'm throwing out some fire-ass questions. 
you would think they would take it as a sign of respect because I obviously respect their intelligence and their knowledge or I wouldn't have asked them the question. So that's why my nose is red, Rudolph, and I don't get to play in their reindeer games, but I don't give a fuck. Actually, I had an allergic reaction to my medicine. And uh, it made my fucking nose. It wouldn't stop scratching, itching. But the, back to topic and in this video. Don't look at it as ape versus AMC. You need to look at it as do you trust the captain? And you might say, hell no, I don't trust that motherfucker, that low down bastard. Then you shouldn't be in the play to begin with. Because as we battle those powers that be if the CEO can't be trusted that means they've infiltrated there and there's just no way to win at all there's no use of holding at all but I don't believe that I believe we're gonna win I believe we just gotta give it a little time so there is no battle with me over eight versus AMC cause I'll tell you one more thing and I'll let you go the moment you do it the moment you sell your ape and you go over to AMC, what happened to Capital? Roth Capital or higher. He lost that run up on, on ape. So, that's all I've got for you tonight. I hope this helps you look at this as from the common sense perspective instead of the analytical perspective. And uh, I hope it gives you some encouragement and hope to continue to hold. Love you, be blessed, and I'll see you on the next video. Cold red, there's been a glitch in the matrix. They out here wildin' and it's too much, I can't take